Hi everyone, in this problem we have three polynomials and the question is to uh, subtract and then write the answer in standard form. That means uh, the exponents have to be from biggest to smallest and then find the degree. Okay, let's start by getting rid of all these negatives. So there really is a one here and there's a one here. There's also a one here, but it doesn't really matter because when you take one and you multiply by all of this, you just get this. So we can drop the parentheses here 8x squared plus 7x minus 5. And then here we can distribute this negative 1. So negative 1 times 3x squared is negative 3x squared. And then negative 1 times negative 4x becomes a positive 4x. Then we do the same thing here. Negative 1 times negative 6x cubed becomes a positive 6x cubed. And negative 1 times negative 5x squared becomes a positive 5x squared. And the very last one is negative 1 times positive 3. That becomes a negative 3. Okay, so now uh, we have distributed everything. So now let's combine like terms. And the question wants us to write it in standard form which means the biggest exponents come first. Let's focus on the biggest one first. So let me use a different color. So I think x cubed is the biggest one. So I'm gonna go ahead and write that first. Now let's focus on x squared. Let's see. We have 8x squared minus 3x squared plus 5x squared. Okay, let's do that a little bit slower. So 8 minus 3 is 5, and then plus 5 is 10. So 10 x squared. Again, 8 minus 3 is 5. If you combine these, you get 5, and then you add the 5 and you get 10. What about x terms? We have 7x plus 4x is 11x. And the last thing is just the numbers. Negative 5 minus 3 is minus 8. And that's in descending order, right? 3, 2, 1, boom. So it's in standard form, and it also wanted the degree. So the degree is the biggest exponent, so in this case it's equal to 3. I hope this video has been helpful to someone out there in the world who is trying to learn some mathematics. Good luck to you.